In this video, we will be showing you how order preparation functions in Magento 2 ERP. We are going to be selecting order preparation in the embedded ERP menu. Order selection. The most important step is the first one. We are going to be selecting the entirety of the orders we will be working on. To assist you with this, the extension will be splitting these orders into three tabs. The orders in stock, orders with a product out of stock, and orders put to the side. Here, we have an order which we have put to the side as it has not yet been built. Out-of-stock orders are for those which contain at least one missing product. The second product in red signifies that the product is out of stock. The first in green is in stock. The second product in red signifies that the product is out of stock. The first in green is in stock. Once the second product has arrived, the order will automatically move to the tab in stock. The first step is to select the orders which we wish to prepare. Most of the time we will be selecting the entirety of the orders in stock and adding them to the preparation. Here we have selected three orders. In the tab in progress we will now find the three orders. We may equally partially ship. On this order only one product is available. We may equally partially ship. On this order only one product is available. If we ask the system to add this to the orders in progress, the first product will be added and not the second. The first step is the selection of orders. The second step is picking. By clicking on the button, we will be printing a PDF comprised of two parts. The first half will be a global picking list and will recap all the products which we need to prepare for the orders selected. For example, the third product, Amazon Echo Dot, is needed in three orders. Here, the system will ask to collect three, and later we will split them amongst the orders. The system will also filter the list of products by location in order to create an optimized picking order. In the second half, we have a preparation list dedicated to each order with the essential information of the order and the list of products. The preparation list is for the first order, and here is the second order. Packing. During the first step, we selected the orders. During the second, we generated and handled the picking. Now, we will be handling the packing. By clicking on the packing step, we have two options. Either we can scan the barcode of the order on the top right, or we may select it directly from the scroll down menu. The system will then display the products which are required for the order. We now return to the essential information of the orders, and here the system will wait for you to validate each order. The first option will be to use the buttons to validate the quantities. If the products are equipped with a barcode, we can directly type in the barcode. If the barcode is incorrect, we will receive an alert as well as a beep. If the barcode is correct, the product will automatically be validated. Repeat this step for the entirety of the products with a barcode scanner, or do so manually. The total weight of the order is automatically calculated if the weights have been integrated in the system. If this is not the case, you may input them manually. Now, we validate the packing. We are going to receive a notification of the validation. The system may automatically download multiple documents. The bill, the delivery form, the list of preparations, and the transporter shipping label. Another option, if your Magento solution is not connected to your transporter, is to input your tracking number here. From here, the system will stock the tracking number of the order to notify the client. You may repeat these steps for each order. We will now move on to the next step. We will be using the barcode scanner. Once we have scanned the correct product, the status will change to packed, and we can input a weight to validate. Downloading the PDFs. This step is optional. It allows you to download a PDF document which will contain for all the selected orders your bill and delivery form. Shipping. This is equally optional. This step allows you to mass export the information of orders to your transporter solution, UPS, TNT, and print the shipping labels. We will be able to import a file to input the tracking number at the order level or input the tracking number manually.
the user will then be able to end the preparation by using the button 6, flush shipped orders. This button will remove the orders from the preparation that have been completed. This is all for the embedded ERP order preparation module for Magento 2. Feel free to take a look at our other guides.